Not a toy drive, but a Barbie drive. That's what 10-year-old Jocelyn Martin hosted for the third year in a row. She collected Barbie dolls for those less fortunate, but why Barbies and not toys? I feel like everybody should have a Barbie doll. Friends, family, and other supporters dropped off donations in the South Loop at the Velvet Lounge. I think it's amazing. I mean, I remember when she started it a few years back. It's her idea, her compassion, and her empathy to support other young people. Those girls that don't have Barbies is amazing. Now Jocelyn says that every little girl deserves a Barbie, which is why this year she's aiming to collect at least 1,000. When I was eight, I discovered that not everyone did. And I feel like Barbie just inspires you to be whoever you want to be, no matter who you are, where you come from. She was playing at the park uh, with her grandmother, and it was a little girl who'd never gotten a Barbie doll. She'd never had one, and it made Jocelyn sad. Her mom says that Barbies can represent a lot in a young girl's life. For her, she was an only child, and mommy works. So for her, Barbie was a friend, Barbie was a companion. She learned how to braid hair, she learned how to accessorize. To complete the party, Jocelyn's friend and small business owner came with the cupcakes. I'm like, I'm really excited because she's helping people who need um, toys and stuff. The party was full of love and lots of laughter and attendees all agreed that the Barbie drive was a huge success. Andrea Watson, outside the Velvet Lounge, Urban Broadcast Media.